Sapa! Hey guys, today we're going to be drawing Jack Skellington. I thought. Is that how you say Jack Skellington's name? We sing it. Jack Skellington. You can't do it right, cause you're a man. Oh, men can't sing Jack Skellington's name? No. That's so disappointing. My life is a lie. You have a lot of disappointing stories. Now, let's focus on drawing. Okay. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. What are we doing? Um, Scarlet's in charge today. So, we're drawing Jack Skellington. First, we will teach you how to ghost, sketch, and finish. So what, what shapes are we going to ghost today? Today, we are going to ghost every single little shape of Jack Skellington. Okay, talk us through it. First of all, take your pencil, and this is called an overhand grip. Overhand grip! Overhand grip! <laughs> See, sometimes people like to draw like this. Yeah, that works for ghosting. It's just an overhand grip is better. And I like it because I move from my shoulder, uh -huh. and I get a smoother movement from my shoulder than from my fingers. So, ghosting is where you just do this. And can I draw a little circle on your paper? Go right ahead. You do this, you take it, and then you outline the shape, and then once you get the shape that you want, you just you just draw it. And then, once you're going to outline it, once you're going to outline it, you can maybe erase the lines. We don't really like to erase. You can erase the lines that you did, and then you can pick one of your favorite lines and circle that line. Sounds good. Sketching is where you actually darken the line. Finishing is where you darken the line even darker. Okay, let's do it. Jack Skellington. Jack Skellington. Okay. I still can't do it. It's fine. Again, let's oh, do, I have to do, do I have to Stop slapping me in the face. Do I have to do like a falsetto? Jack Skellington. <laughs> do that again. Jack Skellington. <laughs> Better, but okay. Let's draw. Better. Let's okay. draw some stuff. First of all, take your pencil with an overhand grip. Go, go in a in a very small circle, around the size of this lid. Are you doing his eye first? No, his head. Oh, his head. Oh, I'm gonna do just a portrait. Are you gonna do like a whole body shot? Uh huh. Okay, I'll do a whole body shot. So we're just gonna do. A little head up here like this. I'm going like to do this. a little head, and then finally, once you get the shape, you draw it. So once I feel like I've got the shape in my hand and my arm, <coughs> then I just kind of do a little sketch like this, right? <coughs> okay. That's looking good. Now what? What's next? Uh, I don't know. Okay. Should we draw his eyes? Oh, yes. Next, you will draw kind of little this kind of shape i guess so kind of what i what i've noticed about jack skellington is that his eyes are circles except he uses them to make facial expressions and so if he like goes like this if he's really mad then like the circles kind of get squished a little bit mm -hmm. so i'm going to start with circles my my jack is going to be kind of mad so he's going to be like over here like this Okay, I'm just going to do two circles, and then I'm going to cut into those circles some lines so that I know kind of how to make those shapes. What, uh, I didn't want to lie way too big. That's okay. What, um, what emotion is your Jack Skellington going to have? Is he going to be angry or happy or excited? I think he'll be um, a little angry. A little angry? Cool. Just a little upset. Okay. Or what do we do with Jack's mouth? Well, first of all, you probably draw a really, really thin, slightly curved, like that, like that kind of line. Okay, so I'm going to go like all the way across his face. How's that? Is that a good one? Um, I guess. I'm gonna, have him, I'm gonna have him open his mouth. No. Mine looks more like more of a smile. That's okay. Okay, and then on the corners, every every so often, he has these little stitches. 
He always has these stitches all right. over his mouth. By every so often, I meant like they're kind of random. We're going to have to edit a lot of this video, aren't we? I don't think so. I think it's going pretty well. My Jack Skellington was really weird. What would you change? Because we're just sketching at this point, so you can change whatever you want. Luna? Oh. Luna, hey. Hey! Luna, kitty, get down. Stupid cats, get down. No. Luna's trying to drink the paint water. Okay, so what would you Luckily change? Luckily, it doesn't have to take the whole entire picture. Do you want to change it? Because we've got time. Hurry. It's fine. I got it. It's, it's okay. Okay. I'm fine. All right. So should we finish it now? Or do you want to draw some more stuff? What are we drawing next? How, 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 do his, like, how does his body look? Well, we're going to sketch a little very thin lines. For neck part. And lines for his neck. Like that. A little wider. A little wider than that. Okay. Now the That's thing that wider. I the thing that I like about sketching is if I make a mistake, I can just keep drawing. Until I like how it looks. Okay, what's next? Do his body? His torso? Now you do a little curved shoulder line. Okay. Slightly what I'm gonna do curved. I've I've noticed that his torso is kind of a triangle. And so I'm just going to kind of draw a big triangle like that. That's what I'm going to do. Triangle. Okay, and then he's got tiny little hips. But they're not as big as his shoulders like ours are. They're really little. And so I'm going to have my jack kind of leaning. So I'm going to just take this line down like this. I'm going to have my jack doing a really, really stupid pose. Okay. And one thing I've noticed about Jack Skellington super long thin arms so really quite a bit longer than you'd normally have i'm gonna have him talking to a pumpkin i think that's what i'm gonna do pumpkin head yeah like a jack o <laughs> jack talking to a jack o I'm gonna draw he steps on a pumpkin head and the pumpkin is i'm gonna turn mine over because i'm drawing the pumpkin upside down Okay, so then off of the bottom of the triangle, what do you think? I'm just going to kind of connect that to his hips. And I, I drew him got... and his shoes because he stepped on a pumpkin head and the pumpkin is not happy. Ah, <laughs> that's funny. I'm going to have his big giant legs coming off here hey, like Dad, this. This lead is not really giving me a lot of it. Yeah, you should use a different one. It's just pushing it back. And then off the back, off the back of his jacket. So now that I have like the torso and everything. You forgot the little spikes next to him. Yeah, that's what, was, that's what I was just gonna say. So off the back, I think you should get another pencil. I don't know where one is. Here, use this one. Oh, Luna's still there. Use this one. Stop worrying about Luna. Okay. Okay. So. I'm going to come in, and he's got kind of the bow tie made out of a bat. Spikes. All right, and so we'll just do like a little Spikes. bat face. Spikes. This is how I'm doing mine. Over the pumpkin. Oh, okay. Okay, and then it kind of comes off here like this. And then he's in like a little cheerleader move. Cool. And then he also has coattails, but they're like scraggly ones. So his coattails kind of kind of all fray out, and he's got kind of a real open vest. So I'm just going to show into his shirt like that. This looks really good. Mine looks horrible. Well, it's practicing. Lots of practice. And I think it just doesn't look bad at all. Very uh, fluid. What does fluid mean? 
Uh, not rigid, like not like computer looking. Okay, I'm ready to finish. Are you ready to finish? Mm-hmm. Okay. So talk us through finishing. What are we doing? So take a dark color, like a marker or something. Got it. And then just color in all the lines. And you can pick your favorite right now. Pick your favorite lines? Uh-huh. Yeah, that's kind of cool. And your favorite person, me. Choose me. Or him. We're not going to choose between people's art. No, between the actual person. They we're choosing who we like better as a person? Yes. I don't like this contest. <laughs> Nobody likes your costume. Nobody likes your kind of contest, so that's why we're doing my kind of contest. Mm. So one thing that I'm doing is I'm filling this in as I'm going kind of rough, and I'm leaving some lines behind because I want it to look a little straggly and scraggly. That doesn't look like he's mad. It just looks like he's going to kill this pumpkin. Yeah, that's a good point. Oops, I messed up. I'm going to see if I can work that mess up into my drawing. You could, um, you could do like the bat has, oh, you could do like a, you could pretend that that's like a little collar. Mm, yeah, I'm just going to leave it because I don't mind. I'm going for like a scraggly drawing anyway, so it's cool. One thing I like is right here, when the fabric folds, I like to do little bumps to show that it's folding. I'll copy you. But don't fill everything in, because I'm going to color it. Are you done? Nope, oh, getting close. Do I need to go faster? Yeah, because I'm done. Okay. Okay. These pumpkin guys really love Jack Skellington. Who wouldn't? This one is so happy that the rest of his, that he only has one tooth left. Since it doesn't look like Jack Skellington at all, I'm just drawing some weird hair on this guy. Weird hair guy. Ooh, weird fun. Hair, yeah. What fun? The weird hair. I liked it. Thanks. Cool pumpkin. I wonder why Morgan card pumpkins. I don't know. Maybe she carved pumpkins on pumpkin power. <laughs> Change the name of the channel for Halloween. Mm -hmm. On Halloween we'll do one called pumpkin power. Okay. So there's our Jack Skellington drawing. I'm going to do little pinstripes on his suit. What are pinstripes? Tiny little stripes. Stripes, 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 stripes. Dad, look at how much I have. I put that much. Look. Cool. Good times. Okay, there's some pinstripes. Do a hand down here. Okay, what's next? Coloring! Yeah. That's what his shoes look like. Can I color that in? Yeah, color those in for me. Thanks. I'm just going to scribble it in because they're kind of shaggy. Okay, so we're coloring now. 